Okay guys, I want to do a little bit of update on where I'm at. See if I can get down inside of these ports. Just kind of working the uh, texture and getting ready to remove that rocker bolt lump. I know it's hard for you guys to see. This camera ain't the best. It's so weird how I can see it in person, but the stupid phone. There we go. I've decided to go ahead and remove the rocker lump. Yeah, it's going to be a benefit, not a detriment, so I might as well cut it out. I did play with the idea of just leaving that rocker lump in there just to make it easier on me. But, yeah, that's dumb. So, All right, let me get started on that. Hey, guys, here's a little bit of an outdoor shot of some of the work on these uh, exhaust ports. Raising the roof, uh, going over the uh, oh the valve guide, shaping and all that. Wish I could get a much better lit picture for you. Um, that's still in single, I believe, single cut finish. But I wanted to add this into the video. Hey guys, here's some uh, outdoor update video on the. Uh, intake and exhaust bowls with valve guide uh, I call it shaping or reducing the profile look you can see on that exhaust side how much I've reduced that guide for the boss that thing is in I believe double cut burr finish the entire port it's ready for sanding rolls I've just been trying to get the uh, intake port smoothed out a little bit better and of course I talked about earlier in this video removing that valve or I'm sorry the rocker start rocker stud lump so let's get a look at that real okay quick. let's see if we can get a little bit of an angle to see down in there so you guys can see that rocker lump rocker stud lump removal um, right now it's just in a double cut burr finish I hate the fact that I can stand here and look at it perfectly but then when I try to film it the shadow of the Sun and then the camera won't focus down in the port look right there second one from the left you can really see that I've completely re removed the rocker arm uh, bolt boss or whatever and uh, blended it completely in it. so I'm um, getting real close to hitting the start sanding roll work I will try to get some of that stuff done and give you guys some better pictures okay guys we have everything shaped and everything is in a fairly smooth double cut burr finish which unfortunately means the sanding rolls have to start, which I hate because it's just a long drawn out process that, you know, no one should have to endure. There is the finished in double cut. Keep in mind, this is still just double cut burr finish, but that's the exhaust port that I create. It's got the raised roof, everything's blended. Bowl, you know, bowl cut, bowl blend, you know, valve guide boss shaped and, you know, reducing the profile. But I just wanted to give you guys a little bit better look at it because uh, the videos I was trying to get earlier outside would suck, you know. So I just thought, well, let's throw this in here so they can see a better representation of what it looks like before we start the sanding roll process that we all love so much, so. Anyway, there's that part, and not to be overlooked is the double cut burr finish of the intake port. See the uh, the reshaping of the guide boss, uh, the removal of the rocker stud uh, lump or rocker bolt lump, sorry, and uh, of course you can't see the bowl cut or blend i'll give you guys final no sizes after all the uh, sanding and all that i'll give you the final on the bowl percentages intake and exhaust 
But this was just to show you guys how smooth a double cut burr can be when you're working aluminum if you let the burr if you literally just let the burr just walk you know go across the surface of the aluminum without putting pressure on it you can finish a head ready to bolt on and you're able to run it with a double cut burr finish if you wanted to so anyway let's start the stupid sand and roll process and make them pretty keep watching we're getting there thank you guys for watching please like subscribe and share here's a couple little still photos i took during the process you can watch